Do you own a Polaris Razor? Have you ever heard these horrendous sounds coming from the front differential of your Razor? Then you may be entitled to compensation. I'm just kidding guys, you know what's going on, but I may have a really cool solution for the problem. Check it out. What's up YouTube? Johnny with Grim Razor here. And today we're going to be installing a True Lock. This is from HD Extreme and I will put I'll put a link down in the description below so you can find it. But what this thing does is it puts direct power, direct battery power to the mechanism on your front diff so that you're not having to go through the ECU to get battery voltage to it. Um, fairly inexpensive. I wish I would have got one sooner. Probably would have saved my diff uh, both times. Maybe some axles. I'm not sure. But this is what it comes with. So you get some really good instructions. Pretty detailed with pictures. Everybody likes pictures. There's the actual harness. That's all it is, a harness to bypass it. Made in the USA. Pretty important. He throws in a koozie and some cool stickers. So let's get started. Subscribe, man. Just like with anything you're going to do with electronics of the razor, first thing, remove your ground cable from the battery. That's that. Let's move on. So the kit comes pretty much plug and play with everything. Pretty simple. I've got all the plastics off just to make it a little easier to see. This right here is your four-wheel four drive selector switch. All we're going to do, unplug that. Comes with a plug. Plug that in. All right, everything else, like I say, is going to be pretty much plug and play. But what we do have to do is run these wires through the firewall, through a grommet of some sort. And I've got one that I use for my winch wires. Here is the uh, bus bar is what they call it on the 19 model. But pretty much what you're going to do, the red wire that has the fused, pre, you know, pre-wired fuse in it is going to go to the accessory on the far left. And then this just needs to be a ground. So we're going to put it right here on the ground. So now what we're going to be looking for this right here is the wire that's going to be connecting to the true lock. So follow it up and makes it a little hard because I got my winch right there. So this is the plug from the differential. Follow the wires up, pretty easy. So the thing to think about, this right here has to, this little right here, you have to lift it up and then pull it apart. And then like I said, it's only going to go one way. This is going to plug into here. Make sure that clips down. And this is what's going, this one goes to the differential. And that's it. All we got to do now, make sure these uh, tidy up some of these wires so they don't get into anything. Put a few magic zip ties on there. And that's the install. Alright guys, that's about it for this uh, install for the HD Extreme true lock setup. Uh, if you have any questions about how I installed it, 
just let me know down in the comments i'll try to answer everything if it went good if it really helped you out give me a thumbs up i'm trying to make some good content that everybody can use and make good value if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing if you like videos like this working on the razor or riding some trails some of the coolest trails in the southeast we try to hit all of them and i'm going to put a link for the true lock in the description below so I highly recommend it. Um, I wish I would have gotten it a lot sooner. After learning a lot about the differential and how it works, I think it would have saved, saved me some money in the long run. But appreciate everybody. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks.